Oh my goodness. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption. I'm going to Dutch. Uh, Dutchy Poo. Where are you, Dutchy Poo? Alright. Oh, yeah, I can't run. Annoying. Oh, you're upstairs? I'll come. I'll come. I am coming. I am coming. Don't worry. I'm coming. Oh, no. Oh, no. I know. There's gonna be good times. Country pursuits. Get the deciding vote. But what? We take an insult and scurry off like cockroaches, or deal with business the right way. We don't need to take revenge. We hardly know the guy. This ain't about revenge, Hosea. Angelo Bronte don't mean shit to me. This is about the fact we are planning to rob a bank in his town, a bank that he no doubt protects, a town where his men are gunning for us. Before we do that, we need to put him I out of commission. I disagree. There's always an easier way. There ain't no easier way. Now, I know his type. He is a we gotta rob the bank. We're not just gonna run away. Fools by fear. Now, we pull that stunt in his cesspit of a town. We're doomed. You wanna leave this place? Leave this country? We need that money. I just don't feel good, Dutch. This is it. This is the last job that we are ever gonna pull. Before the year is out, we are going to be harvesting mangoes in Tahiti. Farmers. Eating like an islander. <laughs> Munching on mangoes. You know it. I know it. Forgive me if I can't think too much about the mango harvest. This is I'm... it. Trust me. Arthur. If it's business, well. Business we got to do it. Angelo Bronte stands between us and our future. You'll damn us all. Arthur, come on. You better be right about this one. I am. I've heard that before, and usually I've been right. Uh, if you say I don't think that's true. Normally you're wrong. Does no favors. Come on. We need to go see a man about a boat. A boat? We're headed to a settlement called Legras. I met a boatman there called Thomas who knows these walls. I met a boatman? Why do we need never, a never a good thing, a boatman. Thomas, it is good to see you, my friend. Hello, Mr. Dutch. Thomas, have you met Arthur? Arthur? Thomas is quite the boatman. He's going to help us get close to our prey. The other night we had quite the adventure. Ooh. Catfish. Now, my friend, can I call in that favor? What do you need? You know Angelo Bronte. Well, exactly. We need to make a social call. We were hoping you could row us in quietly one evening around the back of his house. Well, if anyone can, I can. We'll pay you for your trouble. If you bring it we're robbing his house? I thought we were robbing the bank. A business partner, Jules, he's out on the skiff. I need to check with him. Plus, I need to check the traps. Would you come with me? Of course. Arthur? Why not? Shouldn't take too long if we can find it. He lively. Mind you, there's a lot of gators. Uncommon number. Big ones. Great. Okay. Come now, Arthur. It'll take more than a prehistoric reptile to scare you, Shirley. No. I just want to see you meet your match when it comes to a, an aging predator with a big mouth, Dutch. Arthur here is something of a comedian, Thomas, more of a jest. Yeah, funny guy. Funny guy, Artie. Artemis Prime. Look at this chicken. You call this ground? It feels like water to me. Down here, we can't be too picky there, Mr. Arthur. Mr. Arthur, check the traps with me. Search the trap. Can you please check the other one for me, Mr. Arthur? 
Yeah. Empty. This one's empty. Alright. I got a few more set over this way. Mm -mm -mm. Give me a hand here, Mr. Arthur. This trap is stuck in the mud. It happens. Ugh. Help. Ooh. Nothing in this one either? Guess something didn't want to be caught. My God. So it's true. What is? There's been talk of a big old bull, but people talk a lot of nonsense. A big old bull? Well, like a big gator? No, but only some huge could do this. Oh, fantastic. Let's hope it bites you first, Dutch. Should we just keep moving? I don't really want to hang around here much longer. All right. I suppose this can wait. Let's go. We got to go back to your house, bro. God, there's three of them. My God, there's no shortage of them. Good evening. Us or them? Exactly. Come on. I actually want to try alligator. I've heard it's pretty good. It tastes like chicken, apparently. But... I'd knuckle some alligator. <laughs> okay, Arthur, since you appear so at home here, you take the right. We'll go left. What? Just keep your eyes open. What? I'm by myself now? Okay, at least I can move fast. See here. Oh, see that? Up here. That must be him. Okay. Hey, you in the tree? What are you doing? There's a monster. A monster. Oh shit! All right, well I'm gonna come back here. Where'd he go? Oh, let me get in this boat. Stop. I got it loose. Jump. Good man. All right, let's get back to the dock. Yes, please, let's go. Monster, nearly eight feet. What's the average height of an alligator? Or length, I guess. Length. It's probably like 12 inches tall. I'm probably taller than that, but... I don't know what the average length would be. Am I rowing? Who are these fellas, Thomas? Two new friends of mine. I'll explain later. Jules, we are very happy to have right. made your acquaintance. I thought I was going to be out here all... Am I moving? What you doing hiding up in the tree, boy? This gator was huge, Thomas. Twice as big as I ever seen. Twice as angry, too. Oh, shit. I think we hit a tree stump. Yeah, I thought we cleared. You're gonna need to jump in and pull us free. Me? Yeah, just do it. Won't take you a minute, boy. Go on. This is a bad idea. Yeah, it's not gonna be me. Long before it gets anywhere near you. Got a couple of crack gunslingers here. The guns load. You'll be fine. You didn't see the thing. Yeah, neither did you. It's just a myth, Jules. Now pull. Pull, boy. Oh, is that it? Oh no, it's a firefly. Never mind. <clears throat> oh shit. No, I'm going in. No, no, we can't lose the boat. Are 
What? Exit skiff. Alright, bro, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Do I... Alright, I have a gun. Bro. I'm looking, I'm looking. What the hell? Oh, here he is. Alright, come here, bro. Come here. What, is it just disappearing now? Shoot something! Yeah, it's definitely coming after us. No? Oh shit. Oh fuck, fuck, fuck. Eat this, eat this. Oh, fuck. I think he's going. Shit, that is one big old gate. Oh, your boy doesn't look too good there. Here, take this. Try to stop the bleeding. Alright, alright. Okay, son. You're gonna be okay. Apply the bandage. Just thank your old Uncle Dutch. I heard that. Alright, alright. Wrap you up. There's still a lot of blood. You need to put pressure on it. I'm just jamming it in, though? That doesn't make much sense. I've stopped the bleeding. I think you'll be okay. If he don't get a fever, we can bring down a fever. A fever is the least of our worries. Oh, shit. God damn it. Put every bullet you got in him. Why is it? Shit. Don't let him get any closer. He's under the water. Alright, alright. Where's he at? Where's he at? I think it's had enough. No. I don't think so. Can we get back now? Sorry, Jules. Guess all them stories was true. Big and bad. That's unusual. Normally, the little one's angry. Big one's is lazy. Well, I guess he never outgrew his anger. Kind of reminds me of you, Arthur. You know, I don't think I've ever well before, Dutch. I weren't the one squeal. Yeah, well, you weren't in the water with him. And this poor boy was nearly dinner. Can we get some help? Jules been bitten. Uh, oh my Where'd these people come from? Why weren't they checking the traps? He's alive. Just keep him warm. Feed him garlic for the infection. Thank you. Feed him garlic. I'm at your service anytime you need. Thank you, Tom. That's an ugly guy too. Just meet me back here. He's got no. Help me put the boat back out. Sure. I'm gonna head. He can barely. He's got so much eye skin. His eyelids are massive on his left eye. Maybe he's got an infection. Right Bad man. I know. Kill some good folks. Hurt a lot of people. Well, he definitely lacks a certain charm. I'll see you soon. You be safe. You got monsters out here. Well.
I'm back. My friend. You what do you want? Yeah? What do you want? Do I oh wow. A coward to you? Yes. Obviously I do because I look like that milk sop there, but tis no matter. Can you help? Maybe. See, even he is sick of hearing your nonsense, you afterthought of a child. I apologize, sir, for his smell. Why don't we come back here to somewhere more conducive to displays of utter gallantry and deep-seated inadequacy? Well, what did you have in mind? Shoot a bottle off my head. Like, oh, okay, I'll do that. This is getting silly. No, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do that for sure. I'm the brave one. I'm not scared. Uh, I'm a good shot, but... I won't even flinch. I don't want to hurt you, boys. Oh, I can't lose. <laughs> Either I'll prove my masculinity or die and be spared his company. Come, sir, please. Okay, right. man. Listen, just make sure everyone knows you asked me to do this. Of course, of course, of course. You boys are ridiculous. Let's go. Okay. <laughs> you got mine. Good shot. There we go. <laughs> that was Is that all you wanted? What was it? I feel like we didn't do more. Oh, of course you didn't. We all know you're hardly sentient at all. <laughs> Another round, smaller bottles, sir. Please. What? Uh, I don't know. All right, perfect. Please. This creature is unbearable. He needs silencing. <sighs> I'll do my best. As long as she witnesses that I'm doing this under duress. Oh, these boys are so silly. Now is as good a time as any. Should I shoot them in the deck? Damn. Can't kill him? What the heck? Fine, I'll retry. I'll shoot the bottles this time. Ah. Oh. Dude, what is this stance that this guy is in? Like, they're in the weirdest stance of all time. It's like they're about to take a shit. Me too. You keep shooting, sir, and this time you kill the beast. He emerged fully formed from the swamps. Helen! Silence, you blackguard, sir. Shoot the wretch. You're deranged. Shoot away, sir. My bottle and his brains, if you please. At least I have brains. Oh my god. Shoot, sir. Why? I must be the bravest man I know. There you go. Now do one while I hop. Do one while I turn somersaults. Uh, shoot me. Oh, give me the gun. Let me shoot him. For all mankind. Uh, I think me and the lady have had enough. Oh, I don't blame you, sir. This man's tongue, I would run too if I could. Here, for your skills and talents. Mm, thank you. Money? Now, brother, I am going to walk Helen home. Don't follow Helen me. Keller? She has an elderly aunt, and I fear the sight of you could finally finish her off. Helen, is this creep bothering uh, you? You two, come along. Oh, no, there aren't two. There's me and the lizard man. Please, my angel, do not aggregate us both together. Boys, you are too large. Too large, too large. Nope, my sweet. Did he just give me a dollar and 46 cents? Is that what I just saw? A dollar 46? I should go kill him. Oh, fuck, I'm stuck. Oh, there we go. All right, I'm going to end that episode here. Oh, gracias por leer. Thank you for watching. Uh, goodbye.